Are you a dinosaur yet? Subscribe to become one now. Hey, all dinosaurs and fellow boys and girls, I am Dan, and today I'm gonna show you guys my entire collection of dinosaur toys based on DK Dinosaur Encyclopedia. So let's get started. Okay, let's begin with our first figure, which is the Iguanodon. Check this out. The Iguanodon means Iguana Toothed, okay? And here's the figure of the Iguanodon. This is a herbivorous dinosaur. Just gonna place it right over here and let's move on to our next figure, shall we? The next figure will be Stegosaurus, another herbivorous dinosaur. And the name means Roof Lizard. Another herbivorous dinosaur with huge bony plates and four spikes at the end of the tail. Awesome! Let's place all the herbivorous dinosaurs on the left hand side and all the carnivorous dinosaurs on the right, okay? Let's move on. Next, we have a Giganotosaurus and this is actually my most favorite figure from this set. Check this out. The Giganotosaurus is known as the Giant Southern Lizard. Cool, you can actually move the arms and the legs. I'm gonna place this guy right over here. Looking pretty cool. Okay, let's move on. Next, we have the Triceratops. Okay, the Triceratops is actually not based on DK Encyclopedia. This is actually a bootleg toy. But still looks pretty good. You can move the head and you can move all four legs. The Triceratops is known as the Three Horned Face. And not a herbivorous dinosaur, which means it belongs to left hand side. Okay, let's move on. Okay, next we have another herbivorous dinosaur, the Pachycephalosaurus. And where is it? It is right over here. The colors look different, but you know the sculpt and the patterns on this body looks very, very similar. Awesome stuff. Okay, Pachycephalosaurus is known as the thick skull lizard. Okay, also another herbivorous dinosaur, which means the left hand side has plenty of dinosaurs. Okay, let's move on. Okay, next, finally, we have um, a carnivorous dinosaur by the name of Ovi Raptor. And where is it? It is right over here. Okay, the sculpt looks very similar, but the colors look different. Okay, place it right here. Nice! Two carnivorous dinosaurs! Okay, let's move on. Okay, we don't have a figure for these dinosaurs, but we do have one for the Velociraptor. And where is it? It is right over here. They look very similar. The colors look different once again. Even those arms. Check this out. The Velociraptor is known as the Swift Caesar. Okay, place it right over here. Together with the carnivorous dinosaurs. Let's move on. Okay, Triceratops, Ankylosaurus. We don't have an Ankylosaurus, so that's fine. Okay, hmm, very interesting book. I love this book. Next, we have. Hmm, we don't have any of this. I think we might have Prostosuchus. Hmm, no. Oh, we have Silophysis right over here. Silophysis is known as the hollow tailed reptile. It is right here. Check this out. Beautiful figure. But this guy looks huge. It is actually very small. Another carnivorous dinosaur, probably, you know, probably an you know, omnivorous. I'm not too sure. Let's move on. Okay, let's see. 
We don't have this. We don't have this. We don't really have this as well. No Herrerasaurus. Silophysis. We have already covered. No Brachiosaurus. No Diplodocus. I think we might have a Brachiosaurus. Hmm. I have one Argentinosaurus. I will show you guys later on. Okay, the next one should be an Allosaurus. Another meat eating dinosaur. Check this out. Allosaurus. So, the Allosaurus is known as the different lizard. Nice. Place it right here. Okay. Can I make it stand? Yep. Not very stable, I would say. Okay. Um, I'm sorry, guys. The legs are actually slightly warped. But he can still stand. Okay, let's move on. Um, whoa, Ceratosaurus, Comsoc Matters, Apatosaurus, T Rex. Where's my T Rex? Okay, my T Rex is right over here. But this is actually not a DK dinosaur, this is actually a bootleg Jurassic um, Park dinosaur. I place it right over here, okay? I'm sorry, my throat feels very uncomfortable. Okay, next, we have the Corythosaurus. Corythosaurus is right over here. Nice! Let's place it together with the herbivorous dinosaur. And what is the name? I mean, what does the name mean for Corythosaurus? Can you guys please let me know? I have totally forgotten about it. And next, we have the Euplocephalus. Awesome stuff. And it is right here. Beautiful green Euplocephalus. What is the nickname of the Euplocephalus? I don't know. Please let me know. I'm gonna place it right here. Awesome. Okay, let's move on. Next, we have Parasaurolophus. Nice. Parasaurolophus is known as the near crested lizard. Another herbivorous dinosaur. Looks like the herbivorous dinosaurs are catching up. How many of them? Let us count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven as compared to one, two, three, four, five, six. Well done, herbivorous dinosaurs. Let's move on. Okay, next we have some um, Ceratopsians. Euplocephalus. Hmm. Wow, this dinosaur looks very scary, I would say. Okay. Next, Giganotosaurus again. Um, just a minute. Oh, Spinosaurus, but I don't have one from DK. Uh, this is actually another boot lake. So we have seven apiece. Spinosaurus is known as the Spine Lizard. Awesome. Place it right here. But this guy is having some difficulty to stand. Okay, let's move on. Next, we have some Trudon. Um, Deinonychus. Oh, Therry Xenosaurus. Okay, let's have a look at our Therry Xenosaurus. Check this out. Therry Xenosaurus, it's another herbivorous dinosaur, but some says, I mean, some people actually said that um, Therry Xenosaurus is actually a um, omnivorous dinosaur, which means um, it ate both meat and plants, okay? Let's move on. Baryonyx, we don't have one. We have a Pteranodon. Plesiosaur, not really. Where's my Pteranodon? I think it is right inside. Um, the bag, okay. Elasmosaurus, this is awesome. I have one right over here. Elasmosaurus is not a dinosaur. It is a prehistoric marine reptile. Nice. Okay, next. What else? Some pterosaurs. 
Oops. Let me show you guys right here. We have a Dimorphodon, which is um, kind of weird looking. And next, we have a Pachyrhinosaurus. This is another cool looking um, dinosaur. I don't think this is from Jurassic Park or Jurassic World. I'll place it right over here. And here we have a Cordypteryx. I'm going to show you guys the illustration of the Cordypteryx. Please give me one second. Here, here you go. It looks exactly the same as the figure. How amazing is that? Okay, Cordypteryx is going to place it here together with um, the carnivores. Um, this guy can't stand, I, f I think. Okay, next, we have more um, dinosaurs, but they're not inside the book. First, we have a Dimetrodon. Nice. Dimetrodon belongs to the carnivorous dinosaurs. And here we have um, an Oranosaurus. Oranosaurus is known as, I can't remember, Oranosaurus belongs to the herbivorous dinosaur as well. It has a beautiful seal, which I really love it. And here we have a Cantrosaurus, the pointed lizard. Nice, it looks um, similar to a Stegosaurus, just that you know, those bony plates are swapped with these huge pointed bones. And here, what is this? Is this an Apatosaurus or a um, Brachiosaurus? This is actually an Argentinosaurus. Nice. The largest dinosaur ever? Yep. Okay. Let me shift the camera back. Next. Oh, this is one of my most favorite figure. Oops, there's like a um, little damage here, damage piece. This is actually a Sucromimus. Very beautiful Sucromimus. I love it. Oh, looks like our table is running out of space. <coughs> okay, next we have a Deinonychus. Deinonychus, I think this is another bootleg figure because I've actually seen a Jurassic Park figure which looks like this. This guy has some problems standing. Okay, another one. This is nice. This is actually a Carnotaurus. And speaking of Carnotaurus, it will be appearing in Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. The kind of Taurus is known as the meat-eating bull. <coughs> I beg your pardon. Next, what is this? A Brachiosaurus. Nice. Awesome stuff. The front legs are longer than the hind legs. And this Brachiosaurus looks like um a wood leg version of a Jurassic Park figure. And um, here's another figure of a pterosaur, Pteranodon. It is actually not a um, dinosaur. It is a prehistoric flying reptile. And what is this? This is actually a... I can't remember the name. Scaphonyx, as it is written right below, but I can't remember its scientific name. So let's move on. I think that's all. Yep, over to you, Dan. Okay, guys, so this is the entire collection of my DK Dinosaur series. So, which is your most favorite figure from the set? For me, I'm going with Giganotosaurus and Sucromimus. So, number one is here, and number two. And number three, I am probably going with, um, let me see, um, Pachycephalosaurus, as I think it looks brilliant. 
what about you guys please let me know down in the comment section below okay so that's all i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up share it drop me a comment you guys know i read every single one and i always try my best to reply to you and if you're new here i am dan i upload dinosaur and animal videos every single day so make sure you hit the subscribe button um and press the little bell icon to receive notifications whenever i upload a video okay i am signing out now i am dan i'll see you guys tomorrow but before you go check out the previous videos right over here i'm pretty sure that you guys will like them okay goodbye Oh yes, and for all you guys who are coming for um, The Adventures of Little Green Pea, episode number 4, you won't be disappointed. I will be making it later today and you will be able to see it, you know, hopefully by tomorrow Sunday, okay? So stay tuned. Goodbye my friends.